Welcome back, guys, to Sea of Stars. Well, last episode, after reading Duke Aventry's tale, we headed over to the port town of Brisk to enter the Dweller's Fall Arena built to replace the Crater of Strife. Taking on and completing the bronze and silver ranks of his challenge, and having just beat the first round of the gold rank in a bad state, our battling now continues. No stopping now, another win for it. This is to friends, and now for the next combatants from all across the world. Please welcome the basic basement batch. Woohoo! Basic basement batch. Oh no, we got Merc Potter Dog. They don't have a healer. Now, now, let the fight begin. They don't have a healer? We're talking me who didn't heal like an idiot. Sword thingy. I've got myself in a bad way here. I'm going to have to play completely defensive. Oh, it's so stupidly slow. <laughs> My health is not looking good. And that's going to take everyone's shield. <laughs> because why wouldn't it? Have I told you I hate you all? <laughs> and you're gonna get to go in again now because we don't have any living anything anywhere at this point. Oh right, no, I can elbow drop you! I'm not dying. I don't know what you're looking at. I just made a error of judgment really early on in the fight. Like, in the last round. Just a very tiny error of judgment. And I can't even get my MP back on any of these guys. Can I get my combo up, please, so I can attack one of these days? That would be nice. God, they go so fast! Look at this blooming wizard just going every turn! I see a lot wrong with this. Especially because my combo is like literally about to happen, but I'm not gonna get it, which means I'm probably gonna get KO'd by that guy. And then I'm gonna be able to heal full. But, but. And it's a big button, I cannot lie. I need to remove one source of damage. Oh, I got nine health. Maybe I can live if I can block. Yes! I'm still in it, and my combo's building up. I might be able to just evaporate them. for one target every blooming time. He's still not dead! Ow! Stop it! Okay, two turns. How much health are you on? 25. Okay. Everyone else is just like full health still. Uh, I think I'm best off Let's healing light and keep you up and running. That'll get us more on the combo chart. Oh my god. I don't have any living mana on the ground, do I? No? Okay. Let's trust the fact that I can hit a power smash and get the AoE.
which kills the one on the end. I don't know if it's so much as making me earn my goal rank as just the fact that I messed up. See, now at this point I have my ultimate, but I don't want to use it. Because it will erase them, but my combo is also at level 2. So if I can go another turn, I can use that and then get into them. I can heal up and then wreck them. Come on, I can't heal up because this guy just goes every turn. Might have to lower the number of them even more. Zail! I knew I had a great eagle heal right now. Okay, we can do it off this. <laughs> Full health. Destroy. Probably won't destroy the wizard, actually. <laughs> this round only took so long because of how we came into it. My god, it didn't even do anything to the wizard. This is like, I'm alive. Don't know what you're talking about. Cut this wizard. This wizard. You don't need a healer sometimes. You just need damage so you don't need a heal. We all know this lesson. We all know this to be true. Wait, you resist arcane? Damn it! I can't hit it! I'll go another route then. I was hoping to actually get everyone healed up, but it's not gonna work. This fungus spike won't do any damage. We'll at least have full health when we go in. We'll just be a little bit of MP down for Valir. Unless Valir can go, which Valir can. That works out though. I could have done a solstice right now though, look at it. That would have got some more MP back. This has done it! You know what that means? Barely let making it. No way! Is it really happening? Here we are, the gold rank finals! The time has come for us to face not only the gold champion, but the gold standard of champions. The one with unparalleled pecs, unparalleled skill, and unparalleled charisma. Quick, before I lose my mind! Can our rising star defeat the undefeated one? We're about to find out. Join us now, champion of champions. Let the crowd speak your name. Silgain, Silgain, Silgain. <laughs> oh my god! Amazing intro. <laughs> How do you fit? Now, now, let the fight begin. Now, now. This is Silgain. There's a cannon here. Can I hit that? Okay, no. Part of your attacks? Ooh, ooh, sorry. Uh, ooh. Wait, that was 15 damage. That's not really much. I need two living mana. Or a solstice. No, no, need two living mana. <laughs> Some interesting facials. Oh, here we go. <laughs> I knew the lock that I was not going to be able to break was coming. Ooh. 
70% power. Is he using the super sclout? He's got a melon on his head. Ow. But really not that single target. So. Soonrang does this. You have to hope you get the full combo. Maybe this will get me it. It did not. <laughs> Sad. Big sad, big sad. Could have lowered the power more than by using a sun. Oh, uh, ooh, ooh, uh. How rhythmic. Stop hitting Zail. <laughs> One, what is your problem with Zale? Two, if you're going to attack like that, I'm just going to put, like, everything seems to be single target at the moment, so. What if I were to do that on? Why well, you hit me. Solstice strike. Now what? Double sword, double moon I can't do. Give something within the realm of reason. Slap is shot. Di what? Did it jackpot? Slap is shot is the jackpot or something like that. Okay. Can't do two arcane, can I? Like you hate me, honestly. Well, we're elbow dropping the wrestler type guy. Wait, I can't even do it. He's going super slow again, just not on beast. Zero. The number I like the most. Okay, we got three living mana on the board. A full combo. So I can mending light or anything if I want to at this rate. Main thing is he just seems to have an absolute ton of health. Hey, what? We have an uppercut this time? That's confusing. Sucking it all up. How much power is this going to be? Six ninety. Kind of nice. Two moons and two swords now. I don't know if I just break this with this. I'm gonna probably have needed that now. Uh. <laughs> Ooh, uh. <laughs> well, he's not dead yet, so like the muscle's not just for show. <laughs> He's sticking around a fight till the end of time. Oh, two combos again. Just use some skills, of course, because that gets us. Oh. 
And he's not defeated, he's just flexing. Outstanding, they've done it. Sulgain has been defeated. He took a knee. Boost, boost, boost. I still like Sulgain better. The time has come for our young group to face the ultimate challenge. Do they have what it takes? We shall see next time. That was only three ranks, guy. This concludes today's event. Congratulations, boost. The ultimate challenge. Special rank unlocked. The ultimate arena battle awaits. <laughs> Can I save first? Here's your prize for completing the gold rank. Congratulations. A Reaper's Mercy. Ooh. What's that? While HP is about 50%, killing blows leave the target at 1 HP instead. Why? Oh, wait a second. That's when it's used on me. So I can't be taken from... Above 50% to zero. Okay. I think that's how that works. That's pretty good then. That would have been really good on that slug. I probably will have to have that on then. Uh, where's the nearest safe spot? There's a tavern not too far off. You thought it was about leaving the enemy at 1HP? Yeah, well, I think yes. I think that's not hard to extrapolate from the wording. I think that's the first thing you'd look at, the wording. Obviously, I'm the weird one. Is there a safe place in the tavern? Or am I just completely wrong? Really? Turns out I'm completely wrong. It's a pretty much insta-kill blocker. Yeah, I like it. I do not dislike it. <laughs> well, that said as well, everyone's got really good ones on. <laughs> that says it's probably a boss enemy what we're facing next. So the Eye of Yamara is probably rubbish. For that exact purpose. Anyway. From there, let's just save. Because I've done a lot of stuff. Isn't there a save point here? Yeah, oh yeah, that's where it was. God, we've been in the arena for a while. To be honest, arenas nowadays take so much time. I haven't totally spent, like, the last forever in arenas in another game. But I needed to spend forever in an arena here. <laughs> Welcome to Dweller's Full Arena. On these sands, the mighty gather, the mighty prevail, and the mightiest become legend. Will you be participating today? I will indeed. Special rank now. Special rank? How exciting! There is no party limit for this one. Good luck. So everyone can come. Which means everyone's allowed to have something on. Like Spear of Ninja. Rashan has nothing on. So I'll give you the Eye of your Yamaha then. For now. So everyone can play. Which means we've also got more MP to play with. Good day, people of Brisk and Beyond. Welcome all to Dweller's Full Arena. Today is as special as it gets. Our rising champion has decided to shoot for the special rank. Really? Wow. Ding dong. This is too much. I'm calling in sick tomorrow. <laughs> This is it. The time has come to summon the ultimate challenge. Is everyone ready for the real show? Yeah! Let's go! And let us call upon it. The terror of the seas, the devourer of sunken ships. Crustallion! 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 Crustallion, maybe. Crustallion! Crustallion! Oh, wait, was it? Is that? It was always here? <laughs> it was always present the entire time. It was watching our strategies. Now, now, let the fight begin! Guess that did look out of place. Okay, it's just Crystallion to hit. Nothing else. How strong are you gonna be, big crab thing? Oh, what the hell? Treasure chest? Surprising. 
a measure chest, actually. Oh, it's got another one. Oh, shit, what's going on here? <laughs> right, I can break you with Rashan. Who else? You've got a shield up, so that's problematic. You probably block stuff. I'm not even sure. Uh, you on the right require a, a little more doing. Uh, let's get Rashan and take some of that live mana and dump it on this guy. It just instantly went into another one. So the chests are going to open up no matter what. <laughs> oh, lovely. Um, what's going on? <laughs> I'm just looking around going, eh, 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 what? What do I do? Can't AoE them. I can get this one on the left again. That's about it. I reckon I'm about to get very wrecked. <laughs> And I didn't even hit it. Condo throwdown. That hurt. And the chest opens to do thunder. Okay, so the chest attack. When they open up. That's a lot of sword punching. Oh god. <laughs> so the one on the left needs the soul strike, but the one on I have a feeling I should take out one of the chests to lower the amount of stuff that's going on, but then he might just put out another chest. Are these free swords on main guy? And you're one of my swords, though. But then the others can go. So I could disorient you. And then... Double sword that guy? That still means that I'm not going to break... Yeah. Ah, there's poison over there as well now! How the how, hell... How, I must learn how to triple sword at once. I feel like the boss is more problematic then. Okay, so the left chest heals. The left chest heals an absolute ton. The right chest barely deals any damage. Is that how this works? Do I need to kill the left chest? And then see if it gets another left chest. Because that was a lot of healing. That was an inappropriate level of healing. Okay, so you do, you're like a Gulgul. You do a random spell that's AoE. That doesn't really do that much. And I can block it to get MP. Correct? So I need to kill this chest. And block this guy's attacks. That's my current... Working strategy. We'll go with that. Is 
I was just like looking at them going. Two arcane, two swords. One arcane. Can we do the arcane by doing the big disorient on him? That could be the key. Oh, you switch your yeah, yeah. And then we could do the other arcane. With boost. So now we just need two swords. I mean, we could technically do the other arcane with you. And hit everyone, I guess. Get a little bit off the go on the right. Special. When do I use that? Go on the less being a right dick. Uh, you just decided I'm going, and there's nothing you can do about it. Oh. How do I get arcade on this as well? Arcade moon, but no physical. To all debt targets. Blunt arcade and moon damage to a single target. So moon rock can hit this one. Okay. I should be able to switch him for another sword. What's moon rock? <laughs> Not dead yet. And I need to swap for swords on you. Now that actually hurt for a little bit more than I thought it would. <sighs> Shoot! <laughs> okay! attack his blood swords. Okay. I mean, I can disorient, but I need a moon rang to actually really take that down. Oh, no, I could use Veil special. But at this point, a heal's going out to something, no matter what. Yeah, so that one left one really does... I'm not attacking that chest, so I'm quite fine with you healing that guy. That's actually cool. I am okay with this. So it's a case of, can I get Valer out to do... Moonarang on... Five times on the boss when the boss is that close. Oh no, I'm going to mess this up so badly. Oh no, I knew it! I knew that was not going to go very well. <laughs> it's so close, I've got no position! No space. I mean, I killed the hill chest. That's a great go. I don't know if Valer's going to survive this. <laughs> that was a no. <laughs> the interesting thing about that attack was that it really worked by the tone of what came out there. I was really quite surprised. <laughs> Is 
So warbling will get you up. Great singing! That's an anchor! Okay, I need to double sort this chest if I want to break it. Never mind. We don't want to break it. We never did want to break it. I don't know what you're talking about. Why would we ever break something like that? Urchin. Quite a lot of what you're pumping out, sir, seems designed for me to never actually stop you. But I can, I can make it work. I did that wrong, but whatever. So I used present. Double swords for you, is it? Yeah! I can't get anyone else to sword that guy, though. Well, 75% damage is better than taking more damage than that, I guess. I could just lunar shield it. That would work. That also makes me use a skill, which builds up the combo again. Which I feel is like the best way to possibly kill the chest. <laughs> if I want to actually kill the chest. That's fair for once. <laughs> what? <laughs> It's two solstice strikes. <laughs> or... This is totally fine. What's going on here? What well, just four normal attacks would have done? And I built my combo all the way back up again, so I didn't really use any at all. Thanks lots. Okay, city chest. Oh, I've already got my armor again. Well, I should probably save that until I need it, need it. You're really not moving, are you? Oh, I used my helmet. Whoops. <laughs> I didn't mean to use that. I meant to use Lunar Shield. Of course, it took the place of it, damn it. Oh, well. Damage is damage. This chest is probably dying. Actually, since clearing out that heal chest, things all of a sudden seem completely under control. Famous last words. Fair. No! Wait a second. There are other ways. If I actually hit the jars, that would help. So I need two swords, two poison. I basically need two swords on everyone, but uh, that's not going to happen anytime soon, I don't think. Two poison is Rashad, isn't it? Or is it? The other guy, I'm not just, I'm not stopping, basically. <laughs> That's going through. He does damage. But 60 damage across my party is nothing compared to what else was being put out. So, I can take three if I use L. I do not have a combo to help with this. I mean, I could Solstice Strike to get four. 
But if I can't get five, then what's the point in getting four? I guess he just build up combo quite nicely. I'm sure you're gonna live, combo throw down. He did! Good job there, Lashan. You could petrical as well. Just ignoring this chest on the right. Now what? Oh, a lot of stuff again. I mean, you've got the combo, right? That's, oh, that's pretty much the perfect combo for it. need to be hammered that many times, do you? I mean, I'll lower your power a little bit. Maybe I need to do some more AoE hits like when I shun here to... Two arcane, two moon, and a sun. Blunt arcane and moon damage to single target. Oh, abeyance. Yeah, abeyance works. It's the two moon that I'm more concerned with because of the stupid positioning of the boss. Okay, we're gonna hit it this time, ready? Oh, we've gone to a better position, maybe? Oh, we that's definitely a better position to inhabit. I can actually do the attack now. <laughs> Let's try to do this as one of the attacks. Now we killed the other chest by accident. And my skill does poisonous. Uh, let's just use abeyance then and just knock it that way. Do you think we're ready for the final dungeon yet? I'm left to wondering. It's just the crab now. This is where if you defeat both chests, it just summons both chests back. I was so worried when he went fishing. I'm like, no, don't do it. Don't do it. I mean, I could just use my Ulma here and get my uh, health back up. <laughs> Start building up another one. It's nice how he just takes the time out to heal himself as well during it. Crab's a bit toothless now. I was just wondering how much health it has. And every time we use a combo, we get tons of stuff towards our ultimate. Yes, we only got one arcade. But we got a lot of other stuff, so I'm not going to complain. Uh, sometimes two sword one. Moon one. I 
think that works as just do a uh, crescent arc to save the live mana. Okay, so Zell's out of MP entirely. <laughs> When's it? Oh no, it's actually looking kind of sad now. It ain't looking good. Oh, come on. I can't get through that if I try. Oh, I can if I hit lots of locks, like right now. It has to be someone else, right? Um, so I would have to use the combo on you, so I would have to have you not go this turn. I'd have to hit the combo, or get the combo, off of this turn. Is it Zael to just attack normally to hit one lock? That will build the combo up. The brains of the operation is in. <sighs> I'll have you know. And my special is built up again. Just one A. Mm, mm, mm. It's like, ah! Uh, I thought I had a lock combo you couldn't defeat. He's turned into a tiny crab. Folks, it's finally happened. Business groups have defeated the master of the arena and broken the charm. Look at its size. Crystallium is finally free. Boost, boost, boost. We did it! Ha ha! Congratulations, mister! How do you feel? Amazing! Why is Crystallion so tiny now? Oh, you have something for me? We got a Vitrix Simulacrum! He likes you! Aww! The champions became friends! Talk about a heartwarming finale! Crystallion has decided to move in with <laughs> the Vespertine just got cuter! Okay, and that is it. With that, we get settled living glass in perfect harmony. A better armor, because you can't get a different weapon. Doesn't need anything but the guns. Already in possession. That was a big, long fight. Well, we got it done. So is it now finally actually time for the fated hour? We should have got like a story about him, Crustallion. Well, we can check him out on the ship. Is there anything else for me to do?